Hey guys, what's going on buddy? It's Mr. Abigam here. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another reaction video and today we are back with yet another brand new song here on the channel and uh, I'm so sorry I'm so late to this guys. I am uh, about five days late to this, almost six days late to this and I'm so so sorry but we are finally going to be checking out It's his brand new comeback and it's going to be called Sneaker, their title track. So I'm super excited for this. You guys have been absolutely spamming me about it. I've been super excited to check it out but obviously I've been so busy with all the other stuff that's been released as well. There's also been a massive heat wave here in the UK so my camera keeps overheating I can't film it's been a nightmare but we are finally here guys we're finally checking it out so yeah without further ado we're gonna hop right into it let's go but yeah, as always guys, just before we do jump into it, if you are brand new to my channel, you've never seen my face before, but you have been enjoying these Itzy reactions and any of these other reactions you've been seeing here on the channel, make sure you are subscribed down below, click that button and become a part of the family. As I always say, we'd love to have you join us. We do try to upload these videos every single day. Um, and if you do want to check uh, check out even more content and get access to exclusive stuff that you will not see here on YouTube, the Patreon is the place to go that's linked down below. Over there, we've got loads of exclusive reactions, BTS Run, BTS Bon Voyage. Uh, we've also... We we also take weekly suggestions from Patreons. So if there's something that you really want me to check out, uh, you can leave it over there. And uh, yeah, it's just, it helps to support me greatly. So thanks so much, guys. But without further ado, we have got Sneakers by Itzy. I always look forward to new comebacks from these girls. They're always super, super fun. And they know how to make a fun, just energetic, just like feel good song. So I'm expecting more of the same from them. I don't know though. They could go in a completely different direction. You never know with comebacks. So uh, yeah, here we go. Sneakers by Itzy. Let's do it. Yeah, yeah. Let's go. Like what? Chat on, give a now like that. Come and tell me already done, done. Take a gig of bone and get jet to this. Not my fault. Giving me classic Itzy vibes so far, man. I'm loving the little fun little raps they're going along with. Uh, I'm liking the little beat as well. Okay. Put my sneakers on. This is what these girls do so well. They, they just know how to make a really nice, catchy, like, original hook like that that's fun and it has, like, personality. It's not just a hook that feels very, like, you know, generated and one that lacks any kind of charisma. It really does have that personality of the girls, like, within it, which I really, really love. Okay. This sounds, it sounds like a fun one. It sounds like a fun one. My best is yet to come. Um, obviously, you don't want to bring BTS into this, but that definitely rings a bell from a song from the recent, you know, from recently. I like this little build up. It's really nice, nice and kind of atmospheric before we drop into the hook. <laughs> oh my god, man. That's so catchy. Put my on. Dude, everyone's just got to be singing this when they put their shoes on from now on. Drop down now. I love it. I love it, man. So we've got the the kind of pre-chorus, but we've kind of stripped it back a lot more now. It's more like just piano. We've we've taken away a lot of the instruments that we had before. You can call 
Love that, big fan. Ready, get set, go. This choppy rap, wow. I mean, it's one of those songs you kind of hear it on the first listen and you just know, you know, this is going to go huge. Like it's, you know, it's got a catchy hook. It's got a nice concept behind it. It's got the girls of Itzy behind it as well, which, you know, anything they put out is going to absolutely bang anyway, just because of who they are and just how talented they are all are. Um, but yeah, I mean, first listen, really, really enjoyed it. Catchy tune. I feel like I need another listen though to like, like really, truly appreciate it. And that's good because we obviously have the music video as well, which we're going to be checking out right now. So uh, yeah, Itzy. Let's see what you've done with the music video. They always do something crazy, so I'm expecting big things. Let's do it. We've got a picture of sneakers on the wall. Oh my god. Oh my god, that's it. That's a massive shoe. <laughs> oh my god, dude. The girls are looking amazing. Look at their outfits. Uh. Dude, these outfits are crazy. Like the way they're matching the backdrops that we've got in the video as well. It's so good. Wow, it's very kind of almost royal. They were in like some massive palace or something. Oh. Oh my god, this choreo. The footwork. And it's so fitting because obviously the song, the, the whole concept is about sneakers, which go on your feet. And the fact that we have like a very kind of like, I don't know how you say it, but very like footwork driven choreography is really fitting for that kind of, you know, this concept. And I love the fact as well, like all the clothing is very kind of, you know, high class. Like there's a lot of dresses and jewelry and stuff, but then you've got sneakers on the feet, which don't necessarily really fit. Like you wouldn't normally uh, wear sneakers with like a massive long like wedding dress or something, but uh, you know, they, they make the sneakers stand out a lot more in the video. I love it. Look at them. Dude, that transition was so cool. Into the book. Wait, where are we now? Mission Control. Dude, look at this. Oh, I love it. And look, we've got into like the four by three, uh, the four by three resolution as well, which is really, really cool. It kind of gives it a more old school style. I swear the video is a bit like lower definition as well. We've gone back to like the 1960s or something. Dude, the outfits match the background so well. What was that at the top? Oh my god. Dude, this is this is a bot man. Okay. Oh my god, there's there's literally oh my god, there are sneakers falling on the roof. It is raining sneakers. What? Are they converse? What are they? Woohoo! Oh my god, we've changed it up again. We're now in a sneaker shop. Look at those laces. Okay, I'm not too sure about this one. I don't, I'm not too sure about this sneaker. What the hell? I don't, I don't know if I would wear that. Would you guys wear this? Don't know what I'm saying about that. Dude, this is unreal. What is going on? Look at these. Look at this CGI. Oh, 
Oh my god, the sneakers are flying. I don't understand how we've gone through so many different styles of video in this. Like, we started off quite classy and well-dressed in the palace, and then we moved over to Mission Control. That kind of gave me 1960s or 70s kind of vibes. Like, not, not only the aspect ratio and the quality of the thing, but just how, you know, all the instruments were very old school. And now we've just gone into, like, some futuristic sneaker shop in the middle of, like, a, I don't know, like a fantasy city or something. This is crazy. All the sneakers are, like, flying around everywhere. It's like we've gone through history, one point, one, one point at a time. Woo! I know we're flicking through everything. I love it. Super cool video, man. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. So, like... I, I just love, I've just loved everything about that concept, but especially the video, how they did it. And I love the idea. I feel like they're trying to, they're trying to like make the sneakers stand out within the video by going through time in a way and showing, you know, having sneakers in places where you wouldn't normally see sneakers. Like for instance, in the palace with all the dresses, you don't normally wear sneakers with dresses, but they all had sneakers on. And then in mission and control, you wouldn't normally be in mission control wearing sneakers, but They've got sneakers on and they're just like dancing everywhere. And then obviously with the end bit, all the sneakers were just flying around. I love the whole idea of the video and how they fitted sneakers into that. But also, you know, it's a catchy, catchy tune, man. They they really have got an absolute banger right here. That hook is just like, it's, it's just like magnetic to the head. It just gets stuck in there forever, I feel like. Um, And I mean, you could tell 66 million views in only about six days, five days, I think, which is absolutely crazy. So yeah, sorry I'm a little bit late to this, guys, but we finally checked it out. I'm in love with this concept, in love with what they did with the video as well. Let me know what you thought of it down below, guys. And uh, yeah, as always, thanks so much for watching. But yeah, again, if you guys did have enjoyed today's video, I like it down below, it'd be much appreciated. And if you're brand new to my channel, you've never seen my face before, you have been enjoying these easy reactions you've been seeing, make sure you are subscribed down below, guys. Click that button and become a part of the family. As I always say, we'd love to have you join us, and we do try to upload these videos every single day here. So make sure you subscribe down below. Sorry the uploads have been a little bit slow recently, guys. Again, there's been a massive heat wave here in the UK, so I haven't really been able to film. And uh, yeah, also I've been so busy with other stuff as well. So uh, thank you for your patience. But uh, yeah. Yeah, we'll see you very, very soon, guys. Stay tuned for all the content to come over the next week. And uh, yeah, we'll see you guys very soon. Peace off.